certain units have really developed a science around stopping the automobile. In other words, in their minds, if they stop a hundred cars in the black community, the likelihood of them finding one or two or three violations of some sort is highly possible. Now, of course, you've got teachers, lawyers, doctors, or just average working people who haven't broken any law and are very irritated and aggravated about being stopped by the police. And black folks or minority tolerance of that police brutality has grown very short. Because they won't accept it. They won't accept that treatment. They won't accept that dehumanizing, degrading treatment. That's why more young kids are being killed by the police than ever before. Fifty years later, whether it's Chicago or Baltimore or Detroit, the same thing is happening in all of these cities. It just feels like deja vu.